Before we start off with today's video, I want to talk to you guys about my friends over at Soul Avant Guard. So Soul Avant Guard is a place where you can go and you can explore a wide range of niche perfumery, uh, so much variety. They have discovery sets, they have samples, um, they have a lot to offer for those looking to elevate their collection, those who are curious about other things, of other qualities, of other brands um, in perfumery. All right, so save yourself some money. Use my code DEDRICK10. DEDRICK10 gets you 10% off on anything on Soul of our Guard. All right, so I know a lot of people are uh, really in love with the brand of Mind Games as well. So I got something for you too. You want to head over to Mind Games and do some discovery, do some searching, do some looking, save yourself some money by using Dedrick 10 as well over at mindgames.com. All right. So uh, head over there, see what you like, see what you're interested in. I recommend sampling, sampling, sampling. All right. And then you can get your good feel if you want to make a purchase um, from Soil Vanguard or mindgames.com. All right. So y'all check it out. Uh, let me know what you guys get into, what you guys like. Let me know down below in the comments, man. And um, happy exploring for sure. All right, let's get started with today's video. YouTube, what's going on? YouTube, what is going on? What is happening, man? Of course, it's your guy. One more time, Deja Alex Jr. Now I'm back with another fragrance video. Smell good family. Hopefully everyone is doing well, doing great, doing fantastic. Positive energy, positive vibes. Y'all know how we rock out here on this channel, man. Positive vibes only. All right, so man, listen, it's summertime. We, you've seen all the content possible for summer, right? Um, but one standout in particular, um, part of summer is some people go on summer vacations they go on summer vacations they go on cruises they go to you know you know different islands they you know people just kind of get out and go do something during the summer and summer vacation themed fragrances is a real thing it's a real thing so when you're talking notes like coconut and rum and um you know different fruits um th those are the fragrances that really stand out you know when you are going on summer vacation at least i think all right so today we have eight fragrances here that can really you know uh, uh, uh contribute to your uh summer vacation experience by what you're wearing to highlight uh what you got going on all right so let's go ahead and tap into it we're going to start off with two fragrances from a brand that i'm really diving into and i'm very interested in and um these are just stellar fragrances man and one of them you've heard a lot about from the house of lorenzo of Pazliaga, of Pazliaza, we have Summer Hammer. Quite simply put, coconut, mango, rum. There's a nice sweetness. Like you almost get to kind of get like this honeyed uh, drizzle over like big bowl of fruit. Poured in some rum, the mango and the coconut milk really shine. They really give it this big time creaminess. And if you're on a cruise ship, or you're on an island or you're somewhere uh, on a resort and the tropical vibes are causing you to have on a pair of hoochie daddy shorts and the thinnest button down with your chest out possible fellas and ladies with that in particular sexy swimsuit hey summer hammer you ladies and fellas can wear this this is definitely summer vacation in a bottle hence the name summer hammer which is a great choice this fragrance is getting a lot of traction in Fragcom, and I must say the hype is real. So we're gonna stick with the house, all right, from Lorenzo Pazliaga, and this might be my favorite that I've smelled, even over Summer Hammer, and Summer Hammer is great. From the house of Lorenzo Pazliaga, we're going Arctic Sea, Arctic Sea. Not a lot of talk about Arctic Sea, but man, when I got, a, got my nose on the sample, and I wore it out through like just a, uh, two sprays on the inside of my left hand. I wore it out. This stuff is fantastic, man. This is a beautiful aquatic fragrance with different different things going on. Woods and fruits and uh, uh, semi-salty nature. This stuff is just different. It's different. It's quite possibly the, the, the greatest aquatic that I've ever got my nose on. And is the DNA like brand new and, and, and out of this world just new? No, it's not. It's... It's kind of like it's taking a little bit from a lot of different um, aquatic vibes out there um, to 
create this Arctic Sea. I, I, I highly recommend getting the samples from anything from the house of Lorenzo Pazliaga, but Arctic Sea and Summer Hammer, Summer Vacation, if you're out and about, you know, and you're doing a lot of, you know, beach walking or, you know, beach parties or boat parties, something like that, man. Like, this is something that could kind of set you apart from everybody around if you have those intentions of doing so. From the house of Lorenzo Pazliaga, we have Arctic Sea. And if I'm butchering the name, I really apologize. But I'm definitely a fan. This stuff is fantastic. Up next, uh, something brand new to the collection, man. And just with my my test wares of this fragrance. Like, I'm going to take this with me on, speaking of summer vacation, I'm getting ready to go on myself with me and my wife to celebrate our uh, anniversary. And this is one that's coming along from the house of Mancero. We're talking French Riviera. Man, this stuff is awesome. Everything that I hoped it would be, it is. That soft, fluffy, white floral uh, uh, description. I can't take credit for that. Shout out to my guy Ross over at TLTG Reviews, but it's it's accurate. You get these soft white florals here, like floppy white flower pads um, with petals. Uh, there's some fruits. There's just cleanliness here, almost like a nice linen, uh, like a linen vibe. It's so nice, man. And uh, it, it's unisex as well, but for me particularly, this is something like on the ride down or on the ride home or, you know, I don't know, something just to help kick it off or end things, you know what I mean? So very easy wear, I think. Um, you know, it depends who you are, what your taste is. If you think this leans feminine or not, I don't think that. I think it's like right down the middle. Just depends on your taste. And this is a great summer vacation fragrance. And for me, most likely I will be wearing this down to where we're going. And um, it'll be, a, it'll be a, a, a really good experience. My wife has smelled this. She's a fan. Um, and French Riviera is really nice. Great for summer vacation for sure. From the house of Mancero, French Riviera. All right. Moving along, man, this stuff is beautiful. It's beautiful. And I'm surprised I have the bottle in hand in my hand because my wife has completely taken over this. Think of creamy coconut and a tart raspberry. Beautiful. From the house of Gritty, we have Tutu Blanc. Tutu Blanc is amazing, man. It's amazing. And at first I wasn't too sure if it was this was gonna be something that was for me, but boy, it is. And it's not sickly sweet. It has a like a vanillic sweetness to this, very airy, um, aromatic type of DNA, but you definitely get a creamy sensation, uh, a coconut vibe, that raspberry uh, nature in here is really good. It's, very, uh, it's a very good blend and great for vacation. You smell this and you think vacation. Like if you're going out on vacation on that, that nighttime, that, that evening vibe or that late night vibe, um, this is something that can get really interesting. Um, my wife has worn this and she has said that the, the humidity and the heat brought this to another level and she was complimented you know, on her girls not out uh, trip that she had a little, you know, a little while ago. But for me personally, what do I get out of it? I get fun. I get relaxation, I get vacation, I get, I'm away from my everyday regular life and I'm somewhere where I could just kind of let my hair down and enjoy where I'm at. That's what I get when I smell this for sure. So definitely summer vacation vibes written all over this and it's really good. You can get a sample of this man for six bucks, so six bucks, so avant-garde, use my code Dedrick10 and you can get some money off of that as well. But pricey fragrance, but a sample, it is definitely worth it. From the house of Gritty, we're talking Tutu Blanc. Definitely summer vacation in a bottle. This stuff is really, really good. All right, up next, kind of continuing the theme of coconut. And um, this is this is good. It made it sent shock waves throughout Fracom when it was released. And it, you know, still probably the most popular uh, from the house, just with the conversation that I see from the house of Zahara off. We're talking Coco Loco. Coco Loco, man, it came through and it <laughs> it did its thing, man. But this is so beautiful, man. You get these different, like a bowl of fruits with this nice cardamom addition here. There's a rummy sensation, like a slight boozy sensation here as well. Has a little bit of a dent, has a little bit ca more character than your, you know, regular bright and airy type of scent. Oh, this is really good. Imagine on a summer date night, right? You're sitting outside and, you know, maybe there's some, you know, there's some fire going or some candles going and you're sitting outside by the water having a nice seafood meal. 
or whatever your choice, you're sitting out by the beachside, you're hearing the waves crash, you and your lady or, or, uh, or your love interest is having a great time. And this is a fragrance that really, like really, you know, caps summer vacation. And I, could, I tend to go to wear this during a summer's night and those type of situations. This is another one I could be bringing on vacation as well uh, with me because I know that we're gonna be stopping by and having some really good food and checking out some really dope places and this is one that smells just really good. It's really good, it's one of the elite when it comes to summer fragrances and um, I love everything about this and it's great for summer vacation. From the house of Zaharoff, we're talking Coco Loco. Coco Loco, really good stuff, all right? Up next, a fragrance that I just, I'm a huge fan of, um, and there's a Lay Parfum edition that's really, really good, but I don't know if I'll ever get it because I've made the decision that, hey, this EDT version is me. Like, this stuff is so smooth, it's cool. It's a cool fragrance, man. From the house of Jean-Paul Gaultier, we have Le Beau EDT. And why do I say I might be good with this over the Lay Parfum? The Lay Parfum is really dope. It, ha it adds, you know, the pineapple and different uh, facets to that fragrance. But this is Tonka, um, Bergamot, and um, Coconut. And the Coconut here is some of the best I've smelled. Kind of fleshy Coconut, doesn't come off synthetic-y. And I'm just really amazed of the quality that you get. And John Paul Gaultier puts out some great fragrances, but this here, this here is is just beautiful and like i said the coconut that fleshy coconut mixing in with that tonka and that bergamot just comes off magical dreamy for the summertime so you know coconut is a vibe for the summertime you know and here you have it again in jean paul gaultier's Labo with the edt so this, this stuff is fantastic i'm talking it's like almost 10 out of 10 for me personally but I've been keeping that a nine out of a 10, but it's really good stuff. From the house of Jean-Paul Gaultier, we have Le Beau, the EDT. This stuff is fire, man. It's fire. All right, two more left to discuss. And this is for, you know, my people who are a, we at the beach from the time the sun comes up to the time the sun goes down and we are running around wild. Keep the drinks coming. We'll get a hamburger here or some French fries there to keep us pushing. But this is the fragrance that kind of meets you know, that type of vibe, vibe in my opinion. Uh, from the house of imaginary authors, we have Fallen Into the Sea. Fallen Into the Sea. A lot of lemon, bergamot, grapefruit, lychee. You get that right, it's the rindy parts of that lemon and the bergamot. You know, this is not fruity, fruity uh, citrus here, but this is rindy citrus. This is adult citrus. The lychee in here kind of balances and smooths it out. The warm sand element, not really too, not, not really sure about that, but definitely the most rindiest and almost sour, tarty parts of the citrus is what you get in this bottle. And that lychee really smooths it out with this powerful fruitiness that it provides for sure. So if you haven't got your nose on lychee and you smell in here, you might not get the best de de depiction of lychee because lychee can be very fruity, like a almost yeah, super sweet, fruity, almost, I won't say vanilla-like, but maybe ambery-like with how sweet it is um, to my nose and my experience, but it, it helps balancing out this big bomb of citrus. And when you're out and about at the beach and it's just one of those fun type of vibes and you're just going until you can't go no more out on summer vacation, this is one for sure to look into from the house of imaginary authors We are Fallen Into The Sea. One of the doper names too for a fragrance, Fallen Into The Sea. Really good stuff here. And last but not least, man, this is one where you can wear, man, and you just really chilling. Let's say you out sightseeing on summer vacation and y'all are on the trolleys, y'all are, you know, y'all are, you know, hopping around at different mom and pop shops, trying different foods and ice creams, and you want something light, you want something airy, you want something crisp, you want something with a little bit of sex appeal, but not too much, all right? From the house of Ormond Jane, we have Levant. Levant, this stuff is awesome. So just think like tangerine juice. Tangerine juice and white florals. That's, that's what you get here. Tangerine juice and white florals, man. This stuff is airy, it is clean. There's a nice musk here, but you definitely get that tangerine, like that orange, clementine, mandarin orange type effect. Some white florals here and a beautiful musk. That's the makeup that you get with this fragrance and it is awesome. It is fire. I've worn this out a couple of times when me and my wife just kind of doing our thing and 
she said, yo, that smells good. It's very airy, very aromatic. Sticks around longer than you would expect. This is not like a three, four hour fragrance. Along the lines of that five or six hours, you can overspray this. Uh, Ormond Jane has some really good quality fragrances, man. And this is another one for summer vacation. So if it's one of them type vibes where y'all are walking out of the hotel and y'all are gonna be out all day, um, and you know, you, you know, y'all experience it in different sights and sounds of where you are, but then you want to hold on to this and reapply this for the rest of the night. You can like, it's just one of those things that it can kind of meet the vibe of where you are. And I really enjoy this stuff. Unisex ladies, you can wear this and enjoy this as well. From the house of Ormond Jane, we have Levant. Levant, great for summer. This is a great, as you can see, I've only had this a couple of weeks and you look at the dent. It just, and where I am in Jacksonville, the heat, and this made one of the best matches for sure. Really good stuff, all right? So those are the eight recommendations that I have for Summer Vacation 2024. There's a tons and tons of content um, out there pertaining to this particular topic, but I wanted to get my spin at it and um, you know put the video together, all right? So y'all let me know what are some of your recommendations? What are some of the fragrances that you have brought on Summer Vacation or you wanna recommend a Smell Good Family for Summer Vacation? Drop them down below in the comments. Looking forward to reading them, all right? So I appreciate y'all as always. Thank y'all for the love. I do not take it for granted. Very humbling experience to see all the appreciation um, that you guys show for this channel. I really do. I really appreciate it, man. All right. So until next time, be cool. Be safe. Take care of yourselves. Positive energy. Positive vibes. As always, baby, splack it up. Splack it down. Splack that thing all around. And remember, what you put out into this world is exactly what you are going to get back. Y'all have fun this summer, man. If you haven't already, get out. Go do something. Get away for a few days a week or whatever you want to do and enjoy the summer because it's going to be cold here again yes we get cold weather here in jacksonville i don't care what they say all right y'all peace splacker